Adaptive Security Device Manager, ASDM, is a Cisco graphical user interface application to quickly configure, monitor, and troubleshoot Cisco firewall appliances and service modules. ASDM offers setup wizards that help you configure and manage Cisco firewall devices, powerful real-time log viewer and monitoring dashboards that provide a glance view of firewall appliance status and health, troubleshooting features, and powerful debugging tools. In this video, we will draw our schematic, configure our Windows desktop operating systems, configure our adapted security virtual appliance, and install ASDM on a Windows virtual machine. I installed Windows 10 and 7 on VMware Workstation Pro because it is more stable than installing Windows directly to GNS3. The drawback on this installation is that GNS3 changes the network adapter settings, so every time you boot up, you have to set it back to bridged. Setting it to bridged allow access to the internet and download Windows updates, Firefox browser, and Java needed in ASDM installation. On GNS3, right-click on Windows 10 and select Start. Go to VMware Workstation Pro, right-click on Windows 10, select Settings, change Network Adapter to Bridged, and click OK. Log into Windows 10 and configure network adapter with IP address 192.168.1.15, gateway 192.168.1.1, and DNS as shown. Notice that Windows Update on Firefox browser has already been installed in this virtual machine. On ASAV, configure outside interface 0 slash 0 with an IP address of 192.168.1.10. Enable the HTTP server and allow workstations from subnet 192.168.1.0 access to the server. Then save the configuration as shown. Switch to Windows 10 and ping our gateway 192.168.1.1 and outside interface 192.168.1.10. Using a browser, log into the HTTP server https colon forward forward slash 192.168.1.10 slash admin. Click on advanced, accept the risk and continue. Now 
At this point, I forgot to create a user account that I can use to log in. So I created Cisco with the highest privilege level of 15. Save the configuration as shown. Download Java and ASDM. Install Java first. and then ASDM Launcher. Run ASDM, and to fix the application error, close it. Right-click on ASDM Launcher, select Properties, and edit the target location as shown. Log in and get familiarized with the application as shown.
Windows 7 ESDM installation is also included in this video. In conclusion, both have identical ESDM installation. The only difference is that in Windows 10, you have to edit the ESDM launcher properties target location, while Windows 7 have no issue. Stay tuned for my next video.